Police charged an IU Southeast professor and her sons in a massive psychedelic mushroom grow operation in Floyd County, Indiana. WDRB's Chris Suter reports some officials are comparing this story and allegations to the TV show Breaking Bad. There's a trust placed in the hands of every professor who steps foot on this campus to help mold the minds of those taking their education to the next level to follow a moral compass. Investigators say IU Southeast art history professor Dr. Ann Allen broke that trust. It pretty much speaks for itself. The Floyd County Sheriff's Department saying she and her two sons, Frederick and Joseph, are behind this massive psychedelic mushroom grow. It's one of the largest complex grows I've seen in my 50 year career. Other officials even comparing the allegations to the popular TV show Breaking Bad, where a chemistry teacher turns to making math. Although they may look the same. They don't always behave the same. Chief Deputy Wayne Kessinger describes an elaborate setup inside this blue outbuilding on the Allen's French Creek Road property. And both floors were completely filled with uh, shelves full of uh, the uh, initial grows, had two uh, uh, growing chambers with lighting systems, had uh, heating systems, airflow systems, Pictures snapped inside show petri dishes, seeds, mushrooms, and more. Inside the house, investigators report finding more mushrooms, LSD, and thousands of dollars. Uh, just from the way things look, uh, it, it's, it's been going on for a good while. Floyd County Prosecutor Chris Lane telling WDRB neighbors have been complaining about the Allens. It got deputies to start sniffing around and staking out the property until they had enough to make three arrests. Our investigation has been uh, going on for a couple months itself. On Ann Allen's IUS bio, she writes of taking students to Polynesian Islands and earning a doctorate at Columbia in New York City. Not quite the same picture investigators are painting of the professor now. In New Albany, Chris Souter, WDRB News. And in the past hour, we have learned Professor Allen was placed on administrative leave pending the university's review of this case. The